107.1. The Blast. D Lemon in the morning. D Lemon in the morning. Yeah. It's D Lemon in the morning on The Blast 107.1. All up in your mouth. Yeah, listen, here we go again. Okay. You remember Miss Honey Buns? Oh. You know, I remember the brown skin honey, shorty that was yeah, dancing to the Meek Mill video wow. on World Star. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. yeah, sir. I Turns remember. out okay. she's only in the eighth grade. Oh. oh, she didn't look like she was in eighth grade when I met her. She had an ID and everything. She had ID. What do you mean she had ID? When, we, when she was at the club, did she? You know, you need ID to get in the club. Ooh. They let her in. She was dancing on the table and all that. Too much. Too much. You were out at the club with an eighth grader. No, 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 no. I'm I was at the club. Home. She was at the club at the same time, but I wasn't there yourself. with her. You know what I'm saying? You know it's what? Anyway, that begs the question. How young is too young to dance on World Star? Let's take it to the people. Call her. You're on the line. D-Lemon in the morning. Hey, yo, Sue. Yo, I just wanted to know if she had a fat ass. <laughs> hey, yo, my dude, you seen the video on the World Star. Make sure y'all also, for some extra footage, check out my blog in simwetrust.com. Make sure y'all click those not safe for work links. Okay, that's the next, next caller. You said too much. Next caller, please. I must say this conversation is deplorable, disgraceful, it's reprehensible. Who is this? This is Pastor Ezekiel from Mount Baptist Church here on 125th Street. The man of God. Amen. Now, what this young lady needs is guidance. I would like you to forward her information to me so that I may soothe her soul and place my hands upon her to anoint her, to show her God's true calling. You know what, Pastor? That's what we're going to do. Just hold the line. We're going to get you that information to your God speed. Thank you for calling. That's... Is that the dude who got locked up for having all them little girls in the church basement? Mm, what sound is that like it sounds like it. I think that dude's in jail. No, I think he got out. You know what? This is a real problem. You know, these kids are growing up way too fast. The girl's 14 years old. She got an ass all over the internet. Okay. Anybody could see it. Her it's parents true. could see it. Okay. Some old crazy ass pedophiles could see it. Mm -hmm. Sim could see it. You uh, know? And simwetrust.com. I feel like that girl needs some guidance, you know? Like, Nikki, why don't you speak to that to that young flower? I agree. She mm. needs guidance. Yeah. Since she already made a name for herself on World Star, I say get that money. <laughs> oh, I get it. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Look, hold up. No. Set up a what? PayPal account. You know, what? post some videos on a private site. No, 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 no. What? Nikki, what about inspiring the youth? The children are the future. Look, if I can get her up out of Section 8, She'll look up to me like I'm Michelle Obama. Uh, okay? yeah, hell no. Girl, if you listening, don't waste that youth. Don't, because it's hard out here. You need to get that money. You know what I'm saying? We doomed out here. Listen to the music we play. Huh. You know what? Let's go to a music break. I got the new one from Mr. EBT. Oh, Dollar Fries. Yeah, it's called Dollar Fries. Oh, Dollar Fries. So D Lemon in the morning okay. on the blast. All up in your mouth. D Lemon in the morning. 107.1 The Blast. You know what I'm going to say, right? Now listen, I was just doing my job, man. We were talking about a serious, relevant issue in the news. In the news? Sim was bragging about drinking with a 14-year-old. Mm -hmm. Nikki essentially advocated a kiddie porn website. Mm -hmm. And the pastor? The pastor? Wait, that wasn't the guy. Yeah, he's out of jail on probation. He gave a 14-year-old girl's telephone number to a registered sex offender. Well, technically, he's still a pastor. You know, and he did his time, so, you know, he could have he changed his ways. You think so? Nah. 107.1, The Blast. This is where hip-hop lives.